What's up guys, it's Vico Kang here, your very own Go Hilo Ninja and in today's video I'm going to talk about the database reactivation campaign. I'm going to explain to you exactly what it is, how to offer to your client and the complete step-by-step -step guide on how to set it up from scratch. So let's start off with the first part I want to explain here. Database is not just an SMS blast campaign, all right? There's email element, voice note and power dial, so much more feature involved into the campaign. I want to explain to you and I'm actually going to show you the real life version what workflow in high level but this is the blueprint behind it i'm just going to minimize myself here um database reactivation our workflow look like this initially we have the initial plus right after that we fragment the audience into three parts the one that replying yes no reply and the one that just replied so basically any lead that reply yes they get put into a nurture that cater to those who positively reply people who don't reply they get tripped in with the initial blast campaign and people who reply they get put into a separate nurture campaign so let's just show you guys what actually happening inside go high Lord. so this is everything inside our real estate snapshot so make sure that you check the link in the description to find out more information about this snapshot and how you can get your hand on it for absolute free so the first thing you want to start off is by going to this database reactivation folder so you can see here we have three different offer one for investor two for seller and each of them have part a and part b right and that is exactly what i just showed you in the google slide just earlier so let's just start off and walk you through one by one and how to actually set all this up so this is the initial blast campaign it has nothing but just sms and the trick to this is that during our initial sms we always ask people to reply yes so people who reply yes they are as hot as or as warm as lead that coming in through a paid traffic such as Facebook ad, Google ad, or YouTube ad. So these people that are replying yes is actually as qualified as a paid traffic lead. So after the initial message is normally have a wait time and then the second and third message is just a follow up. You know, how are you still there? Have you seen the message? Please reply yes. So there's not much to it rather than the first message. That's why the first message is so important that you get the message and the offer right for your client or for your agency now let's go into our second workflow this is involved people that replying yes as you can see here it's triggered by customer reply to this initial workflow containing the phrase yes okay and what it do is that it's create an opportunity we normally create a pipeline with different opportunities so this pipeline would have a stage that said reply and it just said positive reply here and then after that guy you can tag them as positive reply and it's just the usual stuff just sending notification to all of the user in that location so we send both email and sms so it's very very straightforward now the second workflow is based on the people who reply so these guy are the people who just reply who are you? What is this about? Can I have more information? So those are not counted as replying yes. So they would be put into a different category and they would be put into a different nurture sequence. So as you can see here, guys, the trigger based only on the reply. It has no filter after that. And what it do is that it create an opportunity that put them into the reply section and it notify team member and it add a different tag for them. Hopefully that makes sense. So now that you actually understand understand how everything works and what's actually on the table. The next step is to actually go ahead and set everything up for your business and your client business. So the first obvious thing that we need to do guys is actually make sure that we are actually publishing the workflow so make sure that's actually work in the first place just go in there and select publish and save all right now i have done it for the three workflow make sure that you actually publish all of the three workflow the next step is actually go to the initial blast workflow and then add yourself to the test okay so you go ahead and go to test workflow and actually add yourself to the test run test all right the next step is actually grab your mobile phone guys and go ahead to your sms inbox and check if the system have sent you the message and if it does just check in for any misspelling or any grammar error and actually reply yes to the system and actually make sure that the system replied back to you with the nurturing sequence that it's supposed to do. All right, once everything passes the test, the next step is actually go to contacts and actually select all of them and put them into the workflow. You can go ahead and click on this box and click on the robot icon, which is add them all to the campaign. Click proceed and actually pick the right workflow. You can see here, it's just one workflow here and then you can just give it a name, click add to the campaign. You've got three options here, add all at once, meaning that all of the contact, a thousand people, 10,000 people, 
people all receive a text at the same time i highly highly do not recommend that schedule mean that um you still blasting with them all at the same time but you doing it for tomorrow or next week or next year right so you schedule it in the future event um putting in trip is my highly recommend feature to go to so you can pick the start date we can start it on tomorrow at 7 a.m and batch quantity is the number of people that you want to blast at one time i normally do 100 to 200 depending on the size of the list and repeat after is that what is the period between each day so i normally do 100 for every two day i find that's very sufficient for our real estate agent now if you're doing it to a code list that you got from artwork or yellow page anything like that you want to actually increase that frequency and that quantity for your agency and underneath here you just have to select the date i highly recommend that you cancel sunday people don't want to get text on sunday and i just leave the start from and the end time uh, i just leave that blank and i can just go ahead and click add to the campaign now this is our test account um i just don't want to do that right now but you obviously get the whole point of this campaign whoa hold on if you're just checking out what the hell go high level is as a platform or just an aspiring entrepreneur who start their online business we made a free course on how to start your very own software business from scratch and land your first 10 clients in a matter of 30 days and this is the exact same course that we use to help our private coaching students to get results such as this make sure you find a link somewhere around this video to actually get access to the free course now back to the video so this is it guys hopefully you find value in this video you can see this is a very simple and easy procedure for you to do for your client and prospect for your agency if you have a code list again from upwork or yellow page you can just do it as part of the prospecting using email and sms blast you can offer it as a service for your client and you can actually generate lead appraisal and appointment for them without having to pay for a single cent when it comes to facebook or google ad now the one missing piece about this process that i just shown you is is probably the part where I actually upload the contact. You normally get the contact in the form of a CSV file or in a spreadsheet and you have to upload them into high level. We're not going to go through that into this video because we already made a video about that. So make sure that you actually click the link on the top right now and also check the link in the description. We also um, link that as well. And guys, if you get results from this process and this procedure, make sure that you actually like the video, share it to another go high level expert to actually help out the community and comment below what kind of result or any question that you have with this process again guys it's vicos here from vclize online consultant make sure that you actually check out our real estate snapshot that have pre-made pre-done workflow that you just saw straight to your account with one click import and it's absolutely for free if you join us our affiliate if not there's just a small one-time payment fee that you can actually purchase and actually use it forever for your agency this is it see you on the next one hey guys if you enjoy watching the video make sure that you're also checking out this content right there.